Um, hi, thanks for watching this video tour for Castle Cork Drive here in Newport. Here we have a three bedroomed semi detached family home set at the end of a quiet cul de sac in a desirable location. So the property is within walking distance of major supermarkets and the M4 motorway is just a stone throw away. So it's perfect for anyone commuting to Bristol, to Cardiff, or even further. So to the front of the property you are tucked away at the end of a cul-de-sac You do have the driveway on the right also the garage on the right and you've got your side access into the rear garden So we'll make our way into the property where firstly you have your entrance hall This provides access then into your main living area and you've got the convenience of having a downstairs cloakroom featuring a wash hand basin and a WC so the property is decorated neutrally, it's smooth plastered throughout, it is literally ready for someone to pick their furniture up and move straight in. You wouldn't have to do a single thing in here. So you come into your main living space, you've got a large lounge. Originally, um, this probably would have been a lounge diner, but the, ex the, the vendors have had a conservatory on the back to give you a separate dining room. So it opens up this room to be a large space. So you do have a really good sized lounge area. You've got your feature fireplace. You've got a window to the front letting in plenty of natural light. Under the stairs storage cupboard and then plenty of room to fit any living furniture you have. I mean the set is in here at the moment. They're quite bulky and you've still got a lot of space to move around in here. So that should give you a feel of the actual size of this room. You'll comfortably get a large three piece suite in here and still have plenty of room. Again, it's smooth plastered in here on the walls and the ceilings. You've got your coving going around and then you've got your stairs then leading up to the first floor. Off your lounge, you come into your kitchen. Decent size which you have in here as well. Plenty of wall and floor storage units and you've got ample worktop space. You've got a range of integrated appliances as well as having room then for any freestanding appliances that you may have. So you've also got space behind there. So even if you wanted to put a little bistro table out here, another dining table, try this as a breakfast room, you've got that option to do it as well. You will get a table in here. Then you come in through to the conservatory, a lovely little space. As you can see, they have used this as a formal dining area. This could be used as an additional sitting room. It could be used as a garden room. It's got multiple uses of what you can use this for, but the current vendors has it as a dining room, which you can fit a large dining table and chairs out here. It's a lovely space to have. So from the conservatory, you've got access out into the rear garden. Beautifully maintained, well presented out here. There's been landscaped, so anyone who's green fingered, this is absolutely perfect for you. So you've got your decorative stone path leading you around the garden. That also takes you to the side access. And then you've got a range then of shrubs, flowers, bushes, all dotted around. You've got your lawn area with your washing line. And then you've got a section which will take you behind your garage then as well. But all in all, it's a lovely space which you have out here and you're not really overlooked. So we'll go up to the first floor. Up on the first floor, you've got your three bedrooms and the family bathroom. The master bedroom having the benefit of having an ensuite shower room. So it's a nice bright landing. You do have a window on the side, so you do get natural light up here. You've got your air and cupboards with some shelves and your hot water tank. So we'll go into the master bedroom first. It's a spacious double room. You'll probably even get a king size bed in here and you'll still have space then for any bedside tables, wardrobes, chest of drawers. You've also got a built in wardrobe behind the door and the master bedroom has the convenience of an ensuite shower room. You've got your WC, your wash hand basin and your step in shower cubicle. It is tiled from floor to ceiling around the shower unit and then tiles halfway up the wall. The rest is smooth plastered with your spotlight ceilings and you've got ceramic tile flooring. Second room on your right is your main family bathroom. Beautifully done in here. Your wash hand basin, panel bath with a shower overhead and you've got your WC. Again, tiled around the bath itself then halfway up the walls, the rest is smooth plastered. And then you've got your ceramic tile flooring. 
This bedroom, when unable to go in, it is currently used as storage, so it is from floor to ceiling with boxes, but it's a double room. You do have a fitted wardrobe in there as well. You'll easily get a double bed in there and still have plenty of space to walk around. Then you come into your third bedroom, your single room. This for a single bedroom is a really good size considering it's a newer build house. You'll comfortably get a single bed in here. You'll have space for some chest of drawers. And then you've also got the benefit of having built in wardrobes as well. Two windows in here, so it is a nice bright room. So that concludes our tour for this property on Castle Cork Drive in Newport. If you have any questions or if you're interested in viewing the property, please just give the team a call. They'll happily help you further. Thanks for watching. Bye.